If you have watched up to this stage, thank you so much for watching. See you in my next video. to allow it to dry so hello lovely family welcome back again to the channel it's an african woman and it's an f it's an evening in our african village and in today's video guys uh we are going to be cooking our traditional snack uh basically known as uh embelenge and in english i think it's called hard knocks i didn't show you, i didn't show you the process when we started uh, putting the maize in the water so right now the maize is already on the fire boiling uh, when we are making this traditional uh, snack we first boil this maize until it becomes soft as we are doing in the video guys this traditional snack is commonly used by our uh, school children most especially those who are in boarding school because it's the most cheapest snack and a long lasting snack that can last for long at school without getting expired so uh instead of uh, going to the market to spend a lot of money to buy this snack we do make it by ourselves at home It's already night guys and we are still cooking our dry maize that we are going to turn into hard knocks. It's time to check on our maize and see if it has softened. So after our maize is ready, we had to carry it inside the house and put it or display it on the mat to allow it dry. So after leaving our maize to dry for a couple of days, 
we finally had to fry it this is how we do make our traditional snack in our african village after cooking the maize and become soft you have to display it in order to allow it redry again then after you fry it in hot oil We have to fry it until its color changes to golden brown. So our snack is ready and we have to take it out of the oil. prepared two snacks at a go we prepared the daddies and also the hard cones because they are for our children who are going back to school if you have watched this video to this point thank you so much don't forget to subscribe like share and leave a sweet comment for this video let us know how you do it in your village.